hey what's up everyone welcome back it's Sid here and while I was I was doing some Zygarde raids I found out uh, an exploit uh, which makes uh, the Dynamax adventures uh, like really easy so in this video I'm gonna explain the whole process behind it and hold on damn it And yeah, this Zygarde is not uh, hacked or cloned, it's purely legit. I caught it in the Dynamax Adventures. So, hold on, I, I'll, I'll explain the whole process in a minute. Before that, uh, I want you to see that my switch is not hacked. Okay, and I am I am not exploiting the date and time glitch. All right. Now let me connect to the internet. And anybody with a switch with a copy of Pokemon Sword or Shield and a Nintendo Switch Online membership can do this uh, exploit uh, well Nintendo Switch Online is recommended cause it's uh, easier to raid with friends rather than doing it with bots so okay so we'll uh, just go in the raid okay Yes, I want to go in the raid. Anything is fine. You can have up to three Pokemon saved in here uh, with Zygarde or anything else. But I only have Zygarde, so I'm gonna choose Zygarde. And as I have got every uh, Dynamax Adventure Legendary, so she'll tell me that I cannot catch it again. So that's fine with me okay so for this glitch to work uh, sorry not a glitch it's an exploit for this exploit of uh, exploit to work uh, you have to be the leader of the dynamax adventure i mean you have to be the host of the dynamax adventure otherwise this exploit will not work for you because what we are trying to do here is we have to save a route uh, which we found in a previous Dynamax adventure so that that route is uh, suitable for Zygarde okay so to put it more accurately it's like uh, you are successful in a previous uh, Zygarde, ra Zygarde raid with a particular ro uh, route and you have saved that route so that you can uh, try to exploit exploit that route again and again and again with the same rental Pokemon so that you are successful every time that you enter the Zygarde Drive. okay I hope I have explained that uh, correctly anyways uh, I'll set up a link code because I have some friends on discord uh, who I'll be raiding with So you have to set up the code and then invite others and then you have to give the go give the code to your friends. So I gave it to my friends over here. Let them join. okay as you can see that i am the first person to first person in the raid so that i am the leader or the host of the raid so this raid is go going to work for us 
so the route that I have saved is going to work for us let the other people join I'm sorry if you're hearing any background noise, I can't help it, I can't do anything about it until and unless I get a good mic. I think the fourth person is not ready to join, so we'll have to make do with the bots. Alright, I think the fourth, fourth person wasn't able to join. Okay, as you can see, we have Min Chao, since you know, and if I take the Min Chao, we'll get a Skeptile. And we also have Swampert. So the bot took the wheezing that in this route, Skeptile is good, so we could take the Skeptile for this route. Okay, so these are the same Pokemon and the route that I have done previously. I can show you the proof for that after a while. So we are gonna choose water because we want that ice type. And make sure not to, you know, die in, uh, in the raid uh, before you fight Zygarde because Zygarde is the is probably the final is the final boss of the game, so he's like pretty hard to beat. So if you want to skip uh, to the point where we take the ice type and then where, where, where we take the jinx sorry uh, where we take the ice type and then uh, where we fight the zygarde you can do so this is just me completing completing the raid because i don't want to do any cut editing because then people will think that this is a hack or something I did off screen something or something like that
see that so that is bad please avoid uh, killing any pokemon or getting killed so we only have three lives so i don't know how this is going to go it's fine so you can catch them if you want for a chance to be shiny i'm just going to catch everyone Okay, so right now we are not gonna switch anyone because that Cramorant is not good. The bot switch, but that's fine. Okay, so now we are gonna go grass and then ice. You can even go water and then ice, but we are gonna go grass and then ice. The main Pokemon that we have to get here is the Jinx. Okay, we are down at uh, two lives. The Cradily killed the Swampot. Unfortunately.
finally okay that was a long battle i did not expect it to be this long but oh well never mind so nobody switch switches here too uh, because credily credily is not so good against sagar okay now we go to ice because that pokemon is what we want right now in our team so since you know here will switch with jinx because jinx is better than since you know if we had the skeptile we could have uh, switched the skeptile for jinx so just try to uh knock it out as fast as possible All right. We finally got it quickly. Thank God. So the. since you know we'll switch in with jinx and this path is only applicable to me or uh, my save file so you will have a different path altogether Okay here we go the big bad boss of the game So use your strategy or anything that you have to beat up Zygarde We are going to use our strategy
that's big damage Okay, here we go. He transforms into his 100% form. Just hit him hard as possible. Okay, he did me in, but that's fine. We're still gonna win this. Just one more turn and this will be good. Alright, we got him. Thankfully. So, as I have caught the Zygarde already, I cannot catch it, but other people can, and there is a chance of for it to be shiny. Chance for all the four of these Pokemon to be shiny. In fact, so for the uh, for the exploit to work, now you are going to hit the home screen. and end the game rather close the game okay so when you get back in the game again the same route that you took right now with the same rental pokemon it will be saved with the scientist so when you talk with her again she will ask for a penalty and the penalty never increases about 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 10 uh, dynamite ore so even if you do like 20 resets or something it she will still ask for 10 dynamite ore so i think it's more reasonable see it seems that you keep quitting your dynamics adventures midway there that sort of thing is hard on your teammates before I let you join another team, I'm going to ask that you give me 10 pieces of dynamite ore to show that you are serious. Can you do that? Yes. So as you can see, I have 157 dynamite ore. So if I go into another raid now, the same Zygarde raid or any other saved Pokemon raid, I will get the same route as I have got uh, in uh, before uh, in this raid that we did on screen right now okay so, so now just to show you that you can get a, a shiny uh, pokemon in that raid i did this raid previously with the same pokemon the cramoran cradley and the jinx that we got in this video and i got the sh cradley as a shiny in a previous raid which I di did a few days back
all right so this is like legit and now the main thing how do you get a dynamite ore without doing the dynamax adventures well there is there are like two ways for that one is that you trade the dynamite or that a friend tra trades you the dynamite ore uh, with pokemon and the other way is to do a uh, promoted dens or dens in the crown tundra any den whatsoever be it three star two star four star or five star will give you one piece of dynamite ore so what you can do for the best way for you to do is uh, is to do promoted raids daily uh, promoted raids can be done uh, in any uh, anywhere uh, be it in the wild area or the ground tundra or the isle of armor they all give you one or two dynamite ore and one or two armorite ore i think the dynamite ore is limited to one only if i'm not wrong but that is how you get extra dynamite ore so now there are a few things i want to talk about which can mess up the route so if you complete the ra complete the raid like normal it can reset your route and the rental pokemon that uh, you have saved in the uh, in this exploit so if you uh, got the shiny legendary or got any uh, shiny pokemon that you need or that you were hunting you can of course end the raid and then it will reset your uh, uh, this uh, the route so if you do, and if you don't want to reset the route please do not end the raid just click the home screen on the pokemon choosing 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 screen that we get after uh, after doing the raid so keep that in mind and there are a lot of other ways too that uh, can mess this up so make sure the main important thing is make sure you do not complete the raid if you want to keep that route and if you want to save that rental pokemon forever with you and with the dynamite hunting method dynamite ore hunting method that i showed you you can farm for endless dynamite ores anytime you can so you don't even need to do any you don't even need to complete any dynamax adventures for the dynamite ore but yeah that's the glitch and what else do i have to mention let me think i think that's it uh that's it yes and i got this i got uh in the uh, in the earlier week which i caught in the max raid hold on let me show you yeah we first first were met one another on uh, november 6 2020 and it was in the max layer it was level 70 this is purely legit this is not a hack zagard let me confirm okay so i hope that i have explained everything to you and this i think uh, uh, nobody have has discovered this uh, exploit and this makes the dynamax adventures very very easy and the shiny is very very easy to farm so i hope you enjoyed it and if you liked it please leave a like and subscribe for even more uh, awesome videos because i will be uploading pokemon videos from today onwards or maybe tomorrow so yeah so stay tuned for that and take care of yourselves peace bye